are going to make a soft soft bun today I'll show you how to prepare this bun video um, let's move on to video first process is we have to activate yeast for that we need 3 by 4 cup of milk warm milk in this we have to add 1 teaspoon sugar dissolve it well the sugar will dissolve it then we have to add 1 teaspoon of yeast mix it well mix it well it should dissolve well in this milk and then we have to keep it aside for 15 minutes then only the, uh, this act, yeast will activate stir it well and keep it aside leave it for 15 minutes 15 minutes later look at this yeast activated look at this is activated yeast come let's move on to mixer maida and all take a bowl add one and a half cup of maida one and a half cup maida so look at this half cup one and a half cup maida now add half teaspoon salt half teaspoon salt three teaspoon of sugar one two three mix it well one teaspoon milk powder mix it well now we have to add that activated yeast yes Now mix it well. We have to mix like this. Now we are going to add butter. 2 teaspoon of butter. Now we have to add it. Now keep on stir like this for 15 to 20 minutes. Hi friends, 15 to 20 minutes we have to knead it, later look at this, we got a dough like this, now we are going to keep it aside for 2 hours, grease this bowl with soft butter. this bowl now we'll put our look at this we kept our dough in this bowl like this greased our greased bowl with water and close this bowl with damp cloth for two hours look at this this is a damp cloth Keep it like this for two hours. Then we'll see. Later. Hi guys. Two hours later. Look at this. 
dough becomes double in size. Knead it for a minute. Add some flour to it. And knead it for a minute. Now we are going to make a small balls. For that we have to take one aluminium bowl in that grease a butter. Look at this guys, we have to make a ball like this. We have to pull all this things inside it. Make a ball like this. Take a dough like this and do it like this. It's a kitty setter. One more thing I'm showing you. Take a dough, do it like this. sticky don't worry for that this is a consistency so don't worry for this sticky dough this will give us soft bun okay keep it like this in baking pan and again Cover it with damp cloth for 30 minutes. Look at this damp cloth, damp cloth. Keep it aside for 30 minutes. Reheat the pan, adding salt to it and place the wire stand on it. Reheat the pan for 15 minutes in low to medium flame. Look at this. 30 minutes later, the dough poof. We preheated this pan for 15 minutes. Now we are going to place the dough pan inside it. Remove this plate carefully to so hot. Place this dough pan inside it carefully because it's so hot now close it another 15 minutes low to medium flame yes cook it for 15 minutes in low to medium flame Open the lid carefully. Look open. Take this pan out carefully. Apply some butter on top of it. Again cover it with damp cloth for 10 more minutes and it will be ready. Minutes later, look at this, this one cools down. Now we 
are going to take it out. How sweet. Yes, look at this. We got our soft, soft bun. Yes. Look at this. How soft it is. How soft it is. Look at this our bun. So soft. At this, let me take it out one soft bun. Look at this, how soft it is! Yeah, soft, soft bun. Can you able to see it? Yes. This bun is a little sweet and is also known as milk bun or bakery bun. These buns are extremely soft and spongy. This will taste so much better than the ones we buy from bakery. Friends, please do try this homemade bun recipe and share these super soft buns with your friends and family. Also, please do share your feedback about the recipe in the comments below. All the best and happy cooking. Enjoy the taste.